Squeak and Shillington from the Octonauts. Hello! Do you want to discover what marine animals are hidden below us in this sea of water balls? Yeah! Sea turtles are large, air-breathing reptiles that inhabit tropical and subtropical seas throughout the world. Their shells consist of an upper part, carapace, and a lower section, plastron. Hard scales, or scuts, cover all. Sea turtles come in many different sizes, shapes, and colors. Stingrays have broad fins that run the full length of their bodies, giving them a flat, rounded shape. To swim, some stingrays move their whole bodies in a wavy motion that propels them through the water. Other species flap their fins like bird wings and fly through the water. Stingrays have tails that are armed for defense. Some kinds of stingrays have a spine in their tail with a very sharp point and edges that are serrated or notched. A hammerhead shark uses its wide head to trap stingrays by pinning them to the seafloor. The shark's eye placement, on each end of its very wide head, allows it to skin more area more quickly than other sharks can. The hammerhead also has special sensors across its head that helps it scan for food in the ocean. Living creatures' bodies give off electrical signals, which are picked up by sensors on the prowling hammerhead. Octopuses are sea animals famous for their rounded bodies, bulging eyes, and eight long arms. They live in all the world's oceans but are especially abundant in warm, tropical waters. Octopuses, like their cousin, the squid, are often considered monsters of the deep, though some species, or types, occupy relatively shallow waters. Most octopuses stay along the ocean's floor, although some species are pelagic, which means they live near the water surface. Other octopus species live in deep, dark waters, rising from below at dawn and dusk to search for food. Bull sharks are the most dangerous sharks in the world, according to many experts. This is because they're an aggressive species of shark, and they tend to hunt in waters where people often swim along tropical shorelines. Bull sharks live throughout the world in shallow, warm ocean waters.
The giant squid is massive and when full grown can be at least 33 feet, 10 meters, long. These mysterious eight-armed creatures are rarely seen by humans. Most of what we know about them comes from finding them washed up on beaches. Their eyes are the largest eyes in the animal kingdom and are about 10 inches, 25 centimeters, in diameter. Their big eyes help them to spy objects in dark depths where most other animals would see nothing. Like other squid species, they have eight arms and two longer whip-like tentacles that help them bring food to their beak-like mouths. These semi-aquatic mammals feed on fish, squid, and shellfish. They are generally found in open water, where they prefer to fish, but are sometimes found in rivers near the coast as well. These sea lions are an intelligent and social species. They travel in groups of 12 or more and hang out on man-made structures such as piers and jetties. They gather on remote sandy beaches and rocky areas to breed. These animals belong to a family of fish that have long, flat rostrums or snouts with sharp teeth sticking out around the edges. Related to sharks and rays, sawfish use their rostrums to dig under the ocean floor for crustaceans such as shrimp. They also snag other fish like herring by swiping at the prey with their spiky snouts. Small-toothed sawfish mostly live in warm, shallow waters off the coast of the southeastern United States and in parts of the Caribbean Sea. Dolphins may swim through the water as gracefully as any fish, but they are not fish. Dolphins are mammals. This puts them in the ranks of other famous marine mammals such as whales, seals, and manatees. Orcas, or killer whales, are the largest of the dolphins and one of the world's most powerful predators. They're immediately recognizable by their distinctive black and white coloring. Smart and social, orcas make a wide variety of communicative sounds, and each pod has distinctive noises that its members will recognize even at a distance. They use echolocation to communicate and hunt, making sounds that travel underwater until they encounter objects, then bounce back, revealing their location, size, and shape 